it's kind of irritating. It's a good way of promoting things, but it, they don't understand the student gets irritated after some time. One or two messages do, but then completely pouncing on them is not cool. Uh, three months or so from now hopefully uh, mobile number portability will come into play that will empower uh, mobile users to have their own retain their number and change the provider and when that happens the market will truly open up and that is when the real challenge is going to be for the providers to either a sustain their uh, list of subscribers or to be able to win over from the other side that's my guest, Samia Chakrabarti of youth marketing company Concrea Communications in Mumbai, India, discussing the effects of mobile number portability, which enter into the market this year. Now, Samyak, what are the marketing realities that these mobile operators will face with number portability, and how can they garner more of the youth market? That price will not be the deciding factor, because most providers, uh, as you would know, and it will surprise you, that uh, now you can talk for one paise a second that's barely a quarter of a cent if you can if you compare with a dollar uh, so they have been using price as a factor to woo customers which has not worked B they have been focusing on technology but unfortunate reality in India is that a majority of the cell phones being bought today are not high end phones they are the regular uh, functional phones so I think uh, what providers really need to do is to be able to create that kind of a package, um, package the brand in a manner that it engages young people with you rather than you engaging with them. There's a vast difference because you need to be able to create a, a strategy in a way that young people come to you. For example, we are working with the provider here to create something called campus networks. So it's like a closed user group, but friends can create their own pool of uh, a mobile network where they can share um, wallpapers, value added services, create a bank of uh, mobile credit because that's when mostly young people always haggle for credit when you know they have to make that last minute call and their balance is about to get over. You need to find these innovative touch points and really understand what a guy wants beyond technology and price. For more information and presentations on mobile youth in India and other countries, visit mobileyouthnet.com.